What's up all? We are back with another video and in this video I'm just gonna go through uh, basically the Pantheon powers and how to actually upgrade them, right? So basically, once you're going through the acts uh, in Path of Exile, uh, mainly part 2, right? So act 6 till act uh, 10, you essentially kill a certain unique monster, uh, minor gods basically and major gods and uh, you basically get a certain uh, power from them, uh, these Pantheon powers, right? Now, as you can see, the blue text is uh, the basic version of it, right? Of what you actually get with the whole thing. And then uh, you get like um, missions or objectives, I should say. Uh, and essentially, if you capture, for example, the eroding one, you get the second part of this whole thing, right? Just like, for example, here, I've done this already, right? So I've tested it, and essentially, uh, we've done it, and I get both now, right? So I upgraded the Pantheon power itself. Now, to do that, what you need is, uh, well, two things. You need the right map, right? With, with that boss, whatever you want to upgrade, right? It's all different. And the other thing that you actually need is a Divine Vessel. Now, you get this by uh, basically just mapping and, and it drops. This is the second one I dropped. I probably went through about uh, 75 to 100 maps already. Uh, so they're not, <laughs> they're not exactly common, but uh, I, I'm not sure you might actually be able to buy this one as well. I'll tell you later why um, I think that. But uh, let's just jump uh, to what we actually need to do with this, right? So as you guys can see, um, it basically boosts the unique boss of this thing itself. Now, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna show it to you guys. We're basically gonna capture uh, the first one here. Uh, it's basically a spider from uh, the sewer map. And I'll show you how to actually use this thing, right? So what you do, you put the map in the map device and you're just gonna have to put this right next to it. That's all. You activate it, right? Open the map. And essentially when you go in, uh, nothing is really different. You don't see any extra objectives or anything like that. And all you need to do is just uh, go to the boss and uh, kill it, which we're going to do in a second. Okay, so here we are, right? The boss is right here. And I'm going to show you guys. Um, just go ahead and try and wreck the thing. Just real quick. Here. There we go. So, we killed the boss, right? Um, sadly, there's no animation, no uh, mission complete, or any um, message, really. Which is kind of, uh, well, disappointing, because, you know, it's it's not as impactful, right? It doesn't feel that, right? So, I hope they will uh, actually put this in there later on, because, you know, this is just a beta. But essentially, when you've done this, all you do... Go to the map device and you'll see this captured so uh, soul of whatever is that thing i'm not gonna try and say that <laughs> and uh, it says cannot be traded or modified now this is basically the reason why i think that you can actually uh, trade the divine vessel right i haven't seen any on the uh, marketplace but that's the reason why i think you can actually trade an empty divine vessel but when it's done uh, you cannot and with that, all you do is basically go to town and then talk to Sin. Simple as that. And there we have it. Basically, we got the extra one now, right? So we have both uh, the main thing and uh, the secondary one. Now, you can upgrade this two more times, right? And get the rest of it as well. So it's all good. There's only one thing that I'm uh, unsure of right now is that basically whether you're gonna have to do this with uh, every single character or you just do it once and it's done. Right now the way it looks, uh, I have a secondary character and I'm just about to finish Act 8 with her. Uh, I didn't get the extra um, mod here so I'm not 100% sure guys but uh, again this is just a beta so it might actually change over time. So far, it seems like they were planning to do this, uh, so you're gonna have to do this uh, separately. So, if you want, di for example, this uh, extra mod with another character, you're gonna have to capture uh, the boss again with that character, right? And with that, we're gonna wrap this video up, guys. 
Let me know what you think. I hope you liked the video. Thank you for watching and I should see you guys in the next video.